Hi there, this is Solomon Schmidt from HistoryBites.com. Today we're going to talk about Johann Sebastian Bach. Johann Sebastian Bach was born on March 21, 1685 in Eisenach, present-day Germany. His parents died when he was only 10 years old and he was then cared for by his older brother, Johann Christoph. His brother taught him how to play the clavichord, which is similar to the piano. In 1700, Johann Sebastian went to St. Michael's School in Lundberg, Germany, where he was surrounded by many composers. While there, he was influenced and inspired by George Baum, who played the organ. In 1703, Johann became the court musician for Duke Johann Ernst in Weimar, Germany. During this time, he continued to develop his skills with the organ and was an excellent player. A few years later, he moved to Mulhausen, Germany, and then later returned to Weimar, where he lived for many years. In 1723, Mr. Bach moved to Leipzig and became the director of church music for the city. He was also the Kapellmeister at St. Thomas Church. Kapellmeister is a German name for a director of an orchestra or choir. Mr. Bach spent the rest of his life in Leipzig, composing music for the organ, violin, and harpsichord. One of Mr. Bach's most famous pieces is called Mass in B Minor, and he completed it in 1749, just one year before his death. Interestingly, in 1747, Mr. Bach traveled to Potsdam, Prussia, to play for Frederick the Great, who was the king of Prussia at that time. King Frederick played a song on a new instrument called the Forte Piano, and he challenged Mr. Bach to play a better piece than he had played. Mr. Bach composed a beautiful piece of music right on the spot, amazing the people who were watching. Sadly, toward the end of his life, Mr. Bach went completely blind and was not able to finish one of his musical pieces called The Art of Fugue, which he had started working on in 1749. Johann Sebastian Bach died on July 28, 1750 in Leipzig. He was one of the greatest classical composers and one of the most well-known and influential musicians of all time. Comment below and tell me if you know what abbreviation Mr. Bach wrote on each of his music manuscripts. Please give this video a thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and ring the notification bell so you can stay up to date with all of my videos. And until next time, go learn your history.